Hey there, everyone. This is Aokao playing uh, Klonoa, and last time I did 6-2. It felt like I finished the game, but then the game said finish saving, and it didn't end. So, clearly something is gonna something here. Unless it's just the end. <laughs> the ending is just its own thing. I don't know. We're gonna find that out real soon. Right now. Real soon. Hey, all the friends. Remember old man? I barely do. <laughs> Feels like forever ago. Uh, I did skip a few days. <laughs> it's barking. Peachy pie, peachy pie. Oh yeah, everyone's scattering. Whoa, that, that man can jump. Okay. Nightmare energy is already full. Well, there he goes. Oh, what? You're just ahead, though. <laughs> okay. I think this man is going a little bit overboard. Just that's my take. I don't know if he's even a man. Like he's just like a concept, right? Oh, he's now a snake, too. Okay. Alright, that's handy. Oh, we're all just here. That's pretty good. Righto! I love how they just kind of get it, like, immediately. I appreciate that. Yeah, the entire fish family is here. Oh. Well, that's handy in a way. You can drag him away at the very least. This is probably not the time to have this conversation. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> at least he realizes it. Like, honestly, in terms of protagonist, Klonoa's alright. Like, he's very sensible. He's very understandable. Whoa, welcome to the Nightmare Gate. Weird face. Everything is so colorful. Oh, so we're doing a, having another loop boss? Except that one looks like weird loop cake. It's a, it's a floating cake of bread ring. Moon cannons! Of course! These cannons have no fat unless five shots are fired at the same time. Okay. I see. So I gather stuff, give them to all of them. And once they're all in, and all of them, they can fire. Okay. Clearly explaining the system here. Oh, that thing is something. That's my take. It's pretty good. But, and yeah, because he's specifically after me, that's why he's going to be specifically attacking me and not the people hanging out on the cannons. This is, this is thought out. A dream at nightmare's end in the skies of Crest. So, uh, okay, here we got enemies being pushed around. 
Huh. All right, and then I'm like, hey, buddy. And, uh, okay, it is very clearly and Oh, we got, we got armor. Oh, jeez, that's fast. Uh, okay, so... Uh, did that count? That count. Very generous. Big tongue! Oh, shoot. Sticky tongue. Uh, is there something I'm supposed to do? Or I guess not. Oh, I got pooped out. That's un unsettling. Okay, there's still some enemies there. We gotta get to them, though. Maybe approaching them from the front. Hey, look at that. I saved your life, so be happy. Ah, oh, I missed somehow! Okay. Yeah, they come out of his, like, valve on top. So, yeah. Armored men that are running. Now he's gonna do, like, his sneasel attack. The attack where he sneezles. It's not a real verb. Okay, so now he's gonna tongue. That's what you wanna hear about. Yeah, you gotta- Oh! I did that wrong. Okay, I'm probably just gonna die before I can even do one damage. That's okay. We're learning things. Alright, so we got hopping guys and they're all huddled up together. We gotta do- Ah, oh, shoot, I didn't mean to do that. And now I lost my ammo. I sure did that right. So, alright, there's a purple here. I'm gonna get to him eventually. Alright, jump, jump, jump. What? He punched me? That's mean. So, like I predicted, uh, I, I lost all my hits. But that's okay, we're learning. There's like a lot genuinely going on in this fight. How did... It's like my up didn't stick. I'm very glad that they're affected by that, though. There we go. And then, alright, he's gonna tongue, so... Like, he does things... Ah, oh, dude! I keep thinking, like, I don't know, like it would go faster. But it slows down a lot, right? Alright, it's fine, though. So just always flutter when dodging... I don't like that idea. Maybe what I should do is move more. Uh, don't get punched. Alright, you get one of these. Alright, blow hole an enemy out. That's the way things go in Cincinnati. I've never been there. I would know that. Alright, now he's gonna punch. Yeah, uh, kinda has his thing going. Gonna tongue now, but like you just. Oh, Alright. So, yeah, it kind of bothers me to do that because it's a time space where all I can do is that. And again, I'm doing this thing where I'm running behind my enemies. It's not really rational. I should be heading toward them. Like, I, it would be easy. <laughs> be more likely to catch up to them in time. Oh, see, we hit the music loop, and that always feels bad. To me, it kind of sends the message, Dude, buddy, you're so slow about this. Alright, so, only one more- Did he dodge the thing? No, they got hurt. They're purple now. Oh, now he's got this tongue thing! Weird frog thing! Alright, yeah, go towards them, but then they turn around! Man, this is a real jerk. Uh, uh, okay. Catch that. And dodge this. And I can finally get a hidden. Oh, cannons are ready! So he ducks. And guys are out. Everyone's ready, right? Every cannon is gold. Uh, I'm not sure. Okay, there. Whoa! Oh. I guess I didn't expect that the lunar cannons would be that strong. <laughs> Man. I don't know if that's gonna be enough, though. Oh, we're all fighting from the inside. Okay, oh, wow, this is a Lost Kirby game. Like, straight out. Alright, the face of Void. Uh, hi. Can I grab your eyes? Doesn't look like it. Pretty mean thing to do. Grab a person's eyes. I I don't. I can't suggest doing that. So what's happening exactly? 
Okay, well, you still summon people. Laser eyes! Okay, I'm thinking I need to hit the- Whoa, it's ice! Okay. Yeah, I'm thinking I need to throw a... Those are the words I have to share. So are they like... I don't... I, I just miss. I'm bad at aiming. Because I haven't figured out if they're like in the background yet. Okay, they are. So you get in front and then throw... That direction. Like that! Okay. Whoa. Close. Well, alright. I had to sacrifice you to not get hurt by eye spiral lasers. Yeah, uh, with the way this arena changes and stuff. Kinda hard to... Okay, so kind of like... Eh, 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 eh. Let me do that. But like... It's like half his health. Well, we'll see what happens. Yeah, I took a damage there. It's okay because I lost some damage just learning. Alright, so you just put out the diamond in the middle. Did you just like throw up your heart? Your real heart? Your main heart? Okay, so there's the one, but it moves around. And it's actually easier to hit? Yeah, it feels like. Because, like, I don't know. To me, it felt it felt easier to, to, to aim at. Because uh, they would exist in a state between a top and bottom. Oh, he just shattered. I was expecting another form. And I might have another form. Or I'm gonna fall out of his colon. Can go either way. No, he just changed the, the many forms of the snake thing. Oh, we're doing cannon things again? I'm assuming it saves between, well, at least checkpoints between phases. Okay. And the timing's right. All right. Okay. So we're gonna do like a down, and, and they're gonna be shuffling. Good shuffle. All right. So big. Oh wow! You're just destroying lands. Mean. I need lands to land. It's like a little bit like. Did it count? It didn't work, and then I got rainbowed. Look, I was... There's a lot of things happening on screen. There's only so much I can focus on. Okay. Yeah, you're mad. Make rainbows. The angriest rainbow. You're gonna destroy two. You're gonna do that and miss. Yeah, that's my fear. It's missing. Very easy to do. Whoa. Okay. That miss? That also missed. Cool. I don't know, it's kind of like not very obvious. Now there's a big purple draperies. And then he just kind of... Ah! Couldn't tell if he was armored or not. Ugh. God, and I didn't mean to do that, but it protected me, so... I This is very unclear what's happening to me. No, yeah, you are armored. I, I can't grab you. Okay. Well, alright, so I got a sense for all of his attacks. Like, you have to wait. Like, you have to plan. Oh, bot. Oh. And, yeah. Basically. Okay, I was too early. That's fine. You're mad. You're not mad. You're just fast. It's kind of funny though that they put the health, you know, like if it was gonna be like a full health thing. All right, so I'm gonna go here. This is gonna be an ambush. What? Shoot! I'm safe. Uh, okay, two out of five, I think. There's a walking guy somewhere over there. Destroy my platforms, please. I need them to spare. Ooh, three rainbows. You can tell he's getting impatient. Oh, they just kind of disappear entirely from the scene. That's probably smart on their end, actually. Like, let's be real. So good for you. Uh -oh. Okay, good. Not, but. So. Yeah, like the smart thing to do here is to wait. 
high rate jump. I've jumped before in a video game. And I missed. Uh, it just feels bad when you miss. It's like there's... Ugh, you only get a thing like once in a while, right? It just feels like a huge loss of opportunity. Leave. Make the land disappearing. Uh, yeah, so yeah, he's man, whatever, he's always man. Uh, oh shoot, yeah, I saw that happening. It's fine. Still at half health. Waiting for a purple arm. Show up. Point. There we go. Doing all the jumps. Oh geez, they're destroying so many floors now. Like, people need those, you know? Alright. Yeah, that counted. Cool. What? Uh, Alright. Whoa, so many. Yeah! <laughs> Just showing up so subtly to blast them is really funny. Oh! Is that? This is the third time it's been at. <laughs> oh. What? Why are you saying it like that, buddy? Alright, Uncle Noah's gonna do it. It just happens. The HUD's gone. That means something. Yo! My little Orbalon! I mean, he was talking like he was going to bite it, like... in the last video. Like, very... very nonchalantly. Though I'm not sure what just happened. Strange little yeah. pause. Yuhura Egonfu. You're not lined up with your platform, Poppin' Dwarf. Ah, uh, a little smile. Like, they eke out a lot of emotion in that little sprite space. Oh, man. Ah, uh, there's a teal grow. I do think it's a little manipulative how Hupo's voice is so, like, squeaky and childlike. That's done on purpose. Hovering <laughs> 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 stop. <laughs> oh, so he did! Live. Why do you? Well, then why did you? All right, you know what? It's fine. <laughs> it's fine. It really felt like, you know, he sacrificed, but he's fine. He's just not a little orb anymore. Speaking in these dead brown and gray, <laughs> like uh, ruins. What does that mean? Yeah, 
we all saw that. <laughs> That's kind of messed up. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! I love how the clouds are diagonal. The hood reappeared there and that freaked me out. <laughs> Please tell me there is not a copyright associated with the song. of transparency does. It opens up a black hole in the middle of the sky. <laughs> Setting. Like the way they did it is really good. There's an implication that it's because of Klonoa that everything is dead. Like, I know that's not the case, but this is the order of, uh, oh no, that makes sense. Priorities of the universe, get rid of the infection before you start repairing the damages, right? Oh, uh, wow. I don't know if this twist was necessary. Uh, there's definitely a tendency to make like dark little twists like that, and it, I, I don't know what it brings. And I feel the same way about this here, but it's fine. If anything, it's daring. And again, like, target audience is definitely younger, and. This is weird to say, but I think it's something. It's a sort of story that kids need to hear, right? Uh, it's like, you know, like, I was in a military family, and, um... I've experienced the not-black hole version of that, more or less, myself, like... One time, it got me real hard, when I was, I was like... 11, 12, 13, I forget, but like around that range. The, the last time I moved, uh, until adulthood. And, uh, yeah, it's rough. And it's the kind of thing you shouldn't, um, hide away, right? Again, this is a game that is all about respecting the player, the person that's playing the game. Both in storytelling, like it doesn't break thousand new grounds, but it just says a story and it says it without sugarcoating anything. And in gameplay too! Like, does it, is the game ever like super hard? No, but it gets like legit hard still. Especially if you're going after the feathers, like, there's some legit difficulty in there and you know, some good design too. They, they help you out by the further you go in the game. 
giving more lives, and that's fine. But, you know, it doesn't make things free, either. It's a weird thing to say, but yeah, my, my big take with this game is the importance of respect, weirdly enough. I don't know. It's just, it's just kind of like what's in my head. Considering a part of the language they say is like actually cipherable, do you think there's a cipher for a text in this book? All letters are pretty evenly spaced out and doesn't seem to be any punctuation, but to be honest, that's how... I mean, there's no spaces in Japanese, but there is punctuation. Ah, some of these could be punctuations. I don't know. Klonoa, the book! Klonoa! <laughs> I don't know why that makes me laugh. Big ol' exclamation mark. What does that even mean? Okay, Phantom Isle, I mean, no, yeah, like, you need to return yours being sent back to your Phantom Isle. Did, is that the first time that term propped up? Because I genuinely do not remember if this was said before. Final Vision. It's not even a level number. But I think... Finish saving. I think... For the completionist. For those who have claimed all the feathers. It is my belief that there is yet one more thing to do. One more little pose game. I don't know if it's gonna be something abstract, something non-canon, or if it relates to the story in any way. But as I've been saying a lot these days, I'll know tomorrow. <laughs>